This is Mr. Martel from Charge Master. I'm a little bit surprised to meet you here in Munich. Uh, what are you doing in Germany? Well, Charge Master is the largest provider of charging points in the UK. We've uh, just launched our uh, rapid charger, um, which is built in the UK in Luton. And we uh, brought it to Munich to show off to our friends in Germany and the rest of Europe. Okay, so uh, will we see your fast charger in Germany as well in the future? That is intention, yes. It's got certain benefits. It's uh, uh, more compact than other uh, competitive products on the market at the moment. It charges at uh, 50 kilowatts on uh, CCS and Shadowmo, and uh, we're very pleased with the devel development of it. Okay, and what do you think about the German market? Because at the moment there are not so many EVs here. I think that's changing. And uh, all the big uh, motor manufacturers are bringing out plug-in hybrids, you know, BMW, Daimler, Volkswagen. They're all bringing out a range of uh, electric cars. And I think within two years, you'll see many more electric cars on the roads in Germany. What can you tell us about the market in the UK? How does it grow and so on? Well, the, the market uh, for electric vehicles in the UK has been very strong. Uh, the, the, it's trebled over the last year. Um, there's quite strong government support in the UK. There's a £5,000, £7,000, €7,000 subsidy in, uh, in it for cars. And there's been quite a lot of investment by government in the UK for charging infrastructure. Um, so uh, actually, um, it's a good environment in the UK for, uh, for electric vehicles. And what can Germany learn from the UK in that point? Well, I'm sure Germany, the, the motor, manu motor industry in Germany is very strong and I'm sure that they recognize the advantages of, uh, of, of uh, low carbon uh, motoring and we're seeing that they're bringing out cars that are very, very attractive. So I think the German market will be very buoyant in the years ahead. And when we have a look at the uh, future of the charging infrastructure, does AC have a future or do you think uh, the future is DC? Oh, uh, AC and DC, it's a combination as, as uh, for rapid charging, for fast charging, for going long distances, you need uh, DC fast charging at 50 kilowatt. But th there's still a very strong need for AC charging for uh, charging at home, workplace, and what we call destination charging at hotels. And we're, we're in the UK, we're rolling out several hundred charging points at hotels. Every hotel should have a, an AC charging point, so when you stay there, Uh, you can charge your car overnight. And what about the power in the future? In Germany, uh, everybody talks about 150 kilowatts by DC charging. Uh, well, it's, it's driven by the car manufacturers. At the moment, car manufacturers, apart from Tesla, are all saying we need 50 kilowatts. That's, that, that's the limit. Uh, if that changes, we will make uh, higher power charging points. 50 kilowatts is pretty good. It you know, enables you to charge quite quickly. And of course, uh, the faster you go, the harder it is to install a unit because the, the, the power might not be available at that location. And uh, one last question, when will we see the first DC charger from Chargemaster near a German autobahn? Uh, well, I very much expect in the early part of next year. Uh, we're starting to ship units uh, from, uh, from January and uh, Germany is going to be an important market for us. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you.